Hi, good evening, Nazri. Thank you very much for taking time out to attend this interview with us. How would you. you like to introduce yourself to our audience? Uh, first of all, I'd like to thank you for inviting me uh, today for this interview. Uh, I'm Nazri Nasir, former national captain. Uh, also, right now, I'm a line chef assistant coach. Right, thank you, Nazri. Um, the MSL fixtures have just come out. Uh, how are the Lions 12 preparations coming along? Uh, yeah, we preparation very well. Okay, we started uh, training since December. I think the players have been working very hard. Uh, we have a very good pre-season. I think this year we emphasize a lot on and um, fitness. Because uh, as you know, we are getting a lot of young players in the team. We've been playing a lot of friendly matches, uh, home and away. And I think uh, so far with the performance of the players, uh, myself and Fandi is very happy with the, the play performance. I mean, as I said, we've been preparing very well in the season. I think uh, line job will be a very good, uh, good fight for, for this season. So, um, which new faces uh, should we be looking forward to seeing in the Lions 12? This year, we, we have uh, we invited two three players from from, from, uh, from, the, from the club and also from the, the I mean the, the younger teams. Uh, I mean, like I can say, mention to you, Christopher, one of the players that I I discovered him last year during we have a tournament at uh, Vietnam, and basically I'm very impressed with his, his football, his technical abilities, and also his technic his technic uh, technical abilities. So, and for the other players that we are looking at, is we have another one more place, uh, Yud White. Basically, he's one of the played for Augang last year. I think he have a very good season last year with the team. Uh, so, uh, what I want for this season, myself, only one players that who are who are very hardworking, who are committed, and I think basically these two players that we have, uh, I think you can look out for this players that that we have right now. And uh, of course, this year's Sea Games held at home in Singapore. Um, what do you think of this uh, Singapore's uh, chances? I mean, uh, I think this Sea Games squad we've been together for the last two years. I think Coach Ad basically uh, working very closely with the boys. I think he has been progressing very well for last season, and and I'm sure this this coming Sea Game. Uh, I mean, of course, the advantage will be playing in the, the home ground, especially in front of our own crowd. And playing at a spot up, so that will help boost the place. I mean, playing at home team. So I think uh, Singapore team this year for the second squad, I think they have a very good chance uh, to at least for for the semi final. And I mean, anything can happen, you know, yeah. in football. So I hope that they will do and hope for the best for the for the Singapore team. Uh, we understand you're also running your own football academy. Uh, can you tell us more about it? Yeah, I mean, uh, I've been running this academy for the last three years. Uh, called the, the name of the academy is under my name, Nazif, Nazif, Nazif Football Academy. The location is at St. Stephen's School. Uh, we're running from, from as young as four to P6, I mean, 12 years old. Okay, uh, I mean, of course, the curriculum that I'm looking is really more on fun game, especially, you know, these young boys to come to the team, to come to the academy, to have fun, to like the game. Because, because uh, we work very more on the ball skills, more on more on uh, ball feeling kind of thing, and of course, uh, much very a lot more on the basic training kind of thing, basic more on technique. Uh, and at the end, of the, day, the whole thing is about having fun. So I'm I'm very happy we, we that I'm running this academy and it's at the Saint Stephen School and from every Saturday from 8:30 to 10 a.m. Now, PlayPal is a mobile app which uh, allows people to connect with each, with each other through football yeah. and we aim to encourage more people, especially youth, to play the sport. Yeah. So how do you think this will help the local uh, football community? I think with this app that uh, I've introduced, I think it will help a lot, especially for the young players uh, to step up, you know, uh, to, to show their, their ability, their skills, you know, to, to come up and uh, to, to be part of uh, you know the communities you know to to play as much game as you can, so this app will also help uh, the, for the uh, platform for the younger players to for for us on the national side on the FA side to, to basically can spot them their talents you know, so I think it's a very good move for for this app to introduce and I think it will help a lot not only for for, for I mean for them to have fun but also again for the Singapore future in football. Right. Thank you very much, Nazri, for Welcome. this uh, 
inclusive interview. Thank, Thank you very, very much. much. Have a good day. Thank you.